Lori here today with my weekly wax basket. I'm a part of the Two C's collab. Hopefully you're following along with that. And I'm not sure of the name. Now I'm now it's stumping me a little bit. Is it oldies but goodies? I think it is. At least we're using up <laughs> some of our oldest wax. I know that. Pardon. <laughs> not knowing the, the exact title, but I knew what the whole premise of the week was. And it's using up some of our oldest wax, which I think is fantastic because as you guys know, I've been working on that. I had gone through my collection, pulled, you know, March and earlier, March of 2021 and earlier. And then now I started filling in with some April um, wax as well to give me a lot of selection <laughs> and options to be able to work through. And so, yeah, I'm super excited about this week. Pulled a lot of great stuff to enjoy, melt, and, you know, obviously melt and enjoy it. Because, as you know, as we always say, you never know how it's going to do for you unless you're warming the wax and melting it. So I want to do a public service announcement here, a little PSA announcement that you may hear some hilarity, yelling and screaming and laughter going on in the background. So James has a couple of friends over today. He's doing well today. He's feeling well. This last round of chemo really kind of kicked his butt, but you know, we take the good days when we can. And so he's got a couple of buddies over just to kind of relax and hang out. So we're going with it. <laughs> I need to record a few videos today. So maybe more than one where there's some hilarity going on but you know we're just happy to have <laughs> you know a good day today so all right let's see what do we have here i want oh i want to <laughs> i want to welcome you if you're new to the channel i hope you decide to stick around and subscribe down below and i want to welcome you back if you're a returning visitor or subscriber i'm so glad that you are a part of this channel Okay, we're ready to jump in, I think, and, and talk about all of this great wax. So I did pull some coffee scents. I have decided I think I'm going to go with a peppermint or, you know, mint week this week in the bedroom. I've been kind of craving it. So I thought, what the heck, let's do a mint week. We haven't really done mint in a couple of weeks, in a little while. And then I thought maybe for, because I had already pulled fizzy and I kind of changed my mind. So kind of thought maybe I'll melt fizzy in this office. You know, guys know a lot of times I do scentsy in here. I do samples or do extra pieces from the living room. But I thought, you know what? There's no, there's no rules, right? It's what we want. <laughs> so I'm like, I'm going to do some fizzy in this office and see what I think. I think it sounds like a good plan. All right, so let's get moving on the coffee. I pulled this Cold Stone coffee. I think it's Cold Stone Coffee Ice Cream. I think that's what it is. Now this, I don't have a lot of super old coffee, I will say. So it just kind of went with some of the older wax, you know, like the dates for the specific like category. You guys know I store my wax by category. So this was one of the older pieces in there. I'm gonna put it in this bin over here like I always do. This one, this one is not old at all, but I did want to melt this because this came to me from Catherine as part of the collab, she had my name on it in the box and I really wanted to try it. So this is Sugar Melts by Stacy, Dream Beans. So blueberry, dark roasted coffee, caramel, and two pumps of vanilla. So this is new, but I want to try it. So we're going with it. I have a couple things that aren't coffee, but you guys know I tend to melt tea and cakes. Sometimes on off days if I'm not feeling like coffee. So this is Empire Alchemy, Mrs. Potts Spot O.T., the gray stuff, Earl Grey tea, sugar cubes, and a warm smile. So I just have some left here. I have more bags of that because it's my favorite scent from them. But yeah, that's my oldest bag. So we have, this came from the collab, Rose Girls Absolute Coffee. I just love this. I'm probably going to mix in a coffee scoop. That was kind of my plan. And then Britta's Twice as Twisted, Fruit Loops, Tea and Cakes, Cotton Candy Frosting really love that scent okay so those are like coffee slash tea scents and then for the bedroom like I said we're going with mint now I pulled these out because I had started using them in a previous week and I had set them aside so it's perfect so these might not be all old I didn't buy a lot of mint prior to like the fall time but that's okay again oldest in the category for me anyway this is Ava's country covered peppermint mocha I have Teddy Bee's Frosted Mint Circus Cookies. This one is older, definitely. You Serious Clark, which is Eggnog Peppermint Marshmallow from L3. This is VCS Shamrock Shake Mint Cream Vanilla Swirl Milkshake topped with whipped cream, and this is older too. So that's good. I did, I guess I did buy a couple of mints, but not a lot. 
This is Rose Girl's Buttermint Birthday Cake. This came from the first collab. It's To the Moon and Back Creations Peppermint Cake. Peppermint Vanilla Cake, Peppermint Vanilla and Birthday Cake. I have Ava's Country Cupboard Blizzard Cookies. I don't know what this one is actually. I cut this off a little loaf, so that'll be interesting. <laughs> it's mint, I know that. And then a Buttermint from that Small Good Shop, just like After Dinner Mints. So that's a scoop. All right, and then for my bathroom, just pulled a few. Gold Sugar from L3, just have a few pieces of it left. This is a custom from K's that I had done, and it's Avo Bath. We have Sassy Girl Aroma, Surfside, which is Sweet Lavender, Beach Night Sugar Cookies. Have a few there, I can smell it through the bag. Teddy Bee's Boom Booms on the Beach, Apple Infused Coconut Water, Tropical Fruits, Citrus Berries, Tuberose, Suntan Lotion, and Warm Driftwood, which is Beaches of Nath, blended with Creme de Boom Boom. And so this is older as well. I didn't get to that one in a previous week. And Snow Fairy from Rose Girl. So a lot of these you probably saw in a previous week, but I'm kind of, you know, because we're not doing a using up the leftovers this month because I decided I wanted to roll with the theme, but it's perfect to use up some of the leftovers within the theme, right? So win, win, win. Moving on to the living room, I have a couple from Sassy Girl Aroma, Key West Bakery, which is graham cracker crust, cotton candy, blueberry key lime pie, and whipped cream. I have Huckleberry Beach, Beach Night, Huckleberry, Marshmallow, and Cotton Candy. I have a couple of Goose Creek here. I don't, I only have one of each. So I'm gonna do these in alternating warmers, I think. So I have Wildberry and Waffles and then Strawberry Angel Food Cake. So I wanted to use a little bit, I have, I have you know, some Goose Creek that I need to work on. So I need to focus on that a little bit. Perkins Melts, Cherry Till You Float, Cherry fl <laughs> Flushy. <laughs> I don't know if I'd like that that much. Cherry Slushy, Vanilla Ice Cream and, cher and Cream Soda. Got a problem reading that label. This was in the collab, Sugar Melts by Stacy Circus Cookie Explosion. So the two C's collab, pull that out. We have Everything Vice, March Smash Cake, Strawberry Cotton Candy Ice Cream, Clementine Chiffon Cake, Lucky Charms Marshmallow Peeps, Peeps Treats. So we will enjoy that. You know, we put off melting that because, you know, it was one of the smash cakes and you can't, it's hard to recreate it exactly, right? This is Rocket Pop from Hayden Rowe. This is older and almost gone. So I'm hoping, you know, to get, to use up a few of these. Oh, for the Perkins melts, I'm not sure that that's enough for all my warmers. So I had this that I pulled out of the first collab, I believe. Whoville, Cherry Cookies, Cotton Candy, and Jelly Glazed Donut. So since it's cherry, I thought that'd be good to use in combination to like boost it up a little bit. Rose Girls, Escape to Neverland, Orange Sherbet, Pineapple, Raspberry Sauce, and Vanilla Ice Cream. I'm on a quest to use up all of my mini muffins. And I have two of these, sorry. I didn't realize they were the same scent. Okay, so some souffles here. The Pharmacist's Daughter Sweet Confections. Blueberry, iced lemon cookies, and tea and cakes. I mean, that counts as probably something that I could have had in with my coffee, but that's all right. Britta's Wicked Berry Delight. Zucchini bread, strawberry, cherry, and blackberry jam. I have Black Widow Bakery, Pink Sugar, Cake Batter Fudge, Sweet and Creamy. Teddy Bee's Cherry Vanilla Biscotti, Vanilla Bakery Dough, Shortbread, Cherry and Almond. And Teddy Bee's Frosted Lemon Circuit Cookies, Circus Cookies. <laughs> Sweet and Tart Lemon Curd blended with Lemon Buttercream and Frosted Circus Cookies. All right, moving on to the next roll, row. I have a couple, I had this in there before. I'm gonna melt these in alternating warmers. Blueberry Sugar Danish Butter Cookies Pound Cake from L3. So I'm using this, it's not necessarily old. But I only had one of these left from Sassy Girl. Blueberry Waffle Cone, which is blueberry muffin, vanilla bean, and vanilla sugar waffle cone. So I thought, you know, I could, you know, boost that up, put those together and that should be fine. I'm going to do these in alternating warmers from Sassy Girl Aroma, strawberry jam filled Twinkies, sweet strawberry jam with Twinkies and vanilla cream, and pink frosted animal cookies, pink frosting, sugar cookie dough, and frosted sugar cookies. 
Then I have two of this, Fruit Loop Cookies, Animal Cookies, Fruit Loop Frosting, Fruit Loop Frosting, that's interesting, Sugar Cookie Dough and Frosted Sugar Cookie. And then because I am missing part of it, I figured I would, you know, add some of this Fruity Pebbles from that Smell Good Shop as well so that will be nice i didn't use these in a previous week so sugar plum fairy from k's she no longer uses these uses these scent shot cups so we definitely know those are older and then rose girls jumping on sweet lemon clouds sweet lemon confection vanilla crunch donuts cotton candy frosting cup of cake monster cookie and marshmallow smoothie just have a few pieces left so i'm going to supplement this that with birdies making sense sweet but bitter lemon curd and blueberry muffin Right. Next, I have Teddy B's Berry Waffle Cone. Sweet berries combined with a freshly baked waffle cone and creamy vanilla. I have Surfside Sweet Shop. I think I ordered a loaf in this in, in the pre-order, which is shipping soon, I think this week. Birthday cake, marshmallow cream, butter cookies, cake batter, and beach treats, which is beach nights. Pretty sure that was in there. I, I think I have Sadie coming for sure, but I think thought I got one hopefully I don't know I'll get it she offers it enough and then lemon drop from the pharmacist daughter lemon curd lemon sugar marshmallow fluff and sugar waffle cone I have sugared lime from that smell good shop and you guys I don't know how many times this has been in the basket but I don't ever want to melt this I had to force myself I just need to start off the week melt it <laughs> be done so this is strawberry seeds from destination wax along with my beloved <laughs> festive fudge from caviar dreams that I just want to melt or don't want to melt because it was so nice but why why am I hoarding it it's gonna lose all its scent and then I'm gonna be bummed out and I'm gonna say why did I wait so long <laughs> I don't know so that was my basket for the week we kind of went quick I do have a lot of great scents in here I'm looking forward to a great week I do, like I said, I have some fizzy scents that I'm going to use in this office. I have fizzy pop for sure. That was an older mini melter bag from Rose Girls. I'm looking forward to melting that one and enjoying it. So let me know. Hopefully you're participating in the Two C's collab this week and melting along with us, melting some of your oldest wax and enjoying it. So thank you so much for watching and I will see you next time. Bye everybody.